What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more AFK Arena, and today we're going to continue our little guide series through the peaks of time. This time we're going to be stopping by the Divine Realm. So this one, one of the things that you can actually get out of this one here, which is going to be really good for newer players, is a copy of Shamira. I think I'm saying that right, Shamira, correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, Shamira, sounds right, I like that. <laughs> you know me guys, if you're new to the channel... We butcher names left and right. You know who we're talking about. So we're going to go over the divine realm here. So if you guys have not, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure you go enter the giveaway in yesterday's video. We're doing a $100 giveaway. So welcome to the channel. Let's jump into it. Hopefully this will help out some of the newer players out there. And uh, let's make this a nice quick one. So let's go. All right. So in this one, guys, this one is very interesting. It's actually pretty basic. Once you just understand the order you have to do things as you interact with the map, you will slowly start losing these pieces around the map. They'll start disappearing, meaning you won't be able to get to certain places if you take the wrong path. The ultimate goal here are these two islands. I say islands, even though they're attached now, these are the first things to pretty much get disconnected. So there is a chest in this top corner here, and there is a chest in this corner as well. What you need to do is you need to activate these tiles right here. What they do is they actually create a teleportation circle pretty much in the, in the center. And once you step on the center and you get all three of the same color done, you'll get teleported to the appropriate island. So that comes to the decision what do we go for first? You need to hit all three of the same color, but you have to do them in a certain pattern. So what we're going to do, we're going to start off with the green colored one. So you got the green and the blue. What you need to do is you need to start pretty much with the far left side of the pigtails and work your way around counterclockwise. So the first path you're going to take is right here, right up the top and work your way down to this very first green pressure plate. Once you do that, come back to the center work your way down this one right here to this pressure plate and then lastly work your way down here when you do that and i'll actually show you in a second you will get a teleportation circle right in the center so i actually figured i would show you what happens you'll notice i have the first two seals already ready to go we do the last one they're called moon island open you get this very last one and then a teleportation seal activates when you step on it in the center you will be teleported to an appropriate island, beat one of the chief camps, and you will get the final reward. So you have to do this at least two times. You can't get everything 100% done in one run because as you notice from previously, this is a very small little pigtail, tentacles, whatever you want to call it. Very, very small. So you have to do it a second time. So let's jump back in, let's refresh it, and I'll show you the order you need to do it for the blue ones as well. So the second time you come in, if you chose to do the green one first, you have to do the blue ones and you're going to follow a very similar pattern. The first one you're going to go through is right over here to this blue one here. The second one is this second little pen tentacle tentacle right here. And the last one is the closest one right here. So that will teleport you down to this island. Now, just to remember, you might want to jump in here a third time because things like these treasure chests up here, you won't be able to get by doing this. You need to go straight for it in order to get it before it disappears. I'm not sure about this one. I feel like this one you might actually get done. But once you do that, you will finish it up. You'll get all the treasures, all the rewards, and you'll be moving on to, be, uh, to the next one, getting more artifacts, getting more artifact upgrade fodder, all that fun stuff. So hopefully you guys enjoy this one. Let me know if you are enjoying these quick little guys. Again, it's more or less for the newer players out there. I know a lot of you guys who are older players, very veteran of AFK Arena. This is kind of the boring part that you have to do every time you start a new account. But hopefully this helps you if you are new. So hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time.